with just few days left to go until the opening ceremony of the 2016 Olympics in Brazil, Rio de Janeiro, here are the 10 things you need to know about the historic event. Number 1. America's first female Olympic champion had no idea she was even competing in the Summer Games. American Margaret Abbott saw an ad for a golf tournament and decided to enter. Rest is history. Number 2. Rio 2016 will be the first time in Olympic history that a South American country has hosted the Games. The city won its bid in 2009, beating out Chicago, Madrid and Tokyo. Number 3. The 1908 Games were moved from Rome to London because of the eruption of Mount Vesuvius. For, after Athens in 1896 and up until 1932 Olympics, the shortest Summer Games lasted 79 days. There will be 16 days of competition in Rio. 5. There are 7.5 million tickets with prizes ranging from $40 for some swimming events to almost $3,000 for the best seats at the opening ceremony. Most popular events so far are soccer, football, volleyball and handball for Olympics 2016. 6. Around 85,000 soldiers and policemen will be deployed. The largest security force assembled at any event in Brazil's history and twice as large as security presence for London 2012 Olympics. 7. The slogan of the Olympic Games is Rio de Janeiro as Live Your Passion. 8. Two horses have tested positive for PEDs at the Olympics, which is why you might be confused if you ever see Waterford Crystal on a list of Olympic drug cheats. 9. The longest race in Olympic history was a 199-mile road cycling race that was won in 10 hours, 42 minutes, 39 seconds by South African O.K. Lewis in Stockholm in 1912. That's a little more than 4,000 times the time it took Usain Bolt to win gold in the 100 meters at the 2012 Games. Number 10. Every single flag in the world has at least one of the colors on the Olympic flag. Black, blue, green, red, yellow. Which is to say there's not a country that has an all-white flag. Now this marks a wrap on today's show on the Olympics. For more such interesting videos, you better get back to us.